Hello, I am Riley Bryant. I live in Lakeland. I go to Arlington High School and I'm in 11th grade. In the past, I've taken Honors Art 1 and 2 and this year I'm in an Honors Graphic Media class as well as Honors Art 3. In this first piece, I used white charcoal on black paper. It's around 9 by 13 inches. Um, I had to focus on the different textures of the long feathers and the short feathers and the beak and the eyes and I think I was successful with that as well as creating the patterns on the feathers. This is um, in my sketchbook. This is my sixth sketchbook that I've started since um, October of 2021 and each piece is around six by seven inches. This piece started off as a um, sketch of a woman and then I decided that I wanted to add color with alcohol markers and then I wanted to add more color and more life to it by using colored pencils and after did that I want to fill up the empty space with bugs because I like drawing bugs a lot they appear a lot of my art and I created that using a mixture of markers and colored pencils this piece is a collage that I did it's around 10 by 12 inches and I created a sense of unity with it by using a lot of parallel lines and I created a meeting for myself with this piece um, based off of the piece in the back that says time for growth, even though it's covered up because I wanted to create an atmosphere of this piece and I want to create this sense of security and a sense of like safety that I find within my own mind and within my house. This is a bag that I made. It's around 10 by 13 inches. And it was really a process because it started with a sketch and then I did another sketch and then I refined it in Illustrator and then I printed it. I did screen printing on a bag and then I was able to use this bag to give out Christmas presents, which was very fun. This piece is, um, I started with a stencil. I used acrylic for it. I started with a stencil that I made of my own face and then I wanted to add a sense of anger and emotion with it so I used a lot of red colors to it because I really love the color red and it's 11 by nine and a half inches and it won an honorable mention in the Scholastic Regional which is very fun. Um, this piece is another one of my sketchbooks, so it's six by seven inches. And the process of this piece was I found a picture on the internet of this woman, and I wanted to create its emotion through my art. And I used what I had on me, which is my sketchbook and a mechanical pencil, and I really tried to craft, capture the emotion with it and use lines and very messy to create this sense of anger. This is a painting that I did, and it's 11 by, not maybe 11 or 10 inches by 14 inches, I'm not sure, but it's an acrylic painting that I did of my plant because I had just gotten a Swiss cheese plant, and I took photos of it, and then I decided that I wanted to paint it. And with this painting, I really wanted to create a focus, a focal area. So with the, with the leaves in the center, I added extra details and very refine and focus details and around the edges it's looser and more impressionistic and so I use that to create a focus area. This piece is actually one of my favorites in the sketchbook that I've mentioned and it started off as the goal was to make it realistic and then I stepped away from it and then I came back to it and I decided that I was going to completely abandon that and I added white charcoal to the eyes to make them a little weird. And then I used my um, uh, ink brush pen in order to create the stylized look to it. And I'm just overall extremely happy with it. And this is my last piece. It is uh, 14 by 20 inches and it's done with graphite. And it won a silver key in Scholastic, which is very exciting because this is one of my proudest pieces. And I really worked hard on it to create the depth with it, with the contrast of the graphite. And I am very happy it um, was recognized. Uh, this is Riley Bryant. Thank you. Peace out.